Okay, Rachel, I'd like you to help me with this example from lesson six. So the first thing we'd like to do is cover the number outside the parentheses. Would you cover that number, please? Okay, so if you cover that number, the only thing that we see inside is 2x's plus 3. Would you please set up 2x's plus 3 on the scale? And now, what does this 2 outside the parentheses tell you? Do it again. Okay, do it one more time. Same thing, one more time. 2x's plus 3. Okay, so now we have one side of the equation. We have 2x plus 3 twice, and on the other side we have x plus 9. Please set up an x plus 9 on the other side. Wonderful, wonderful. Do you see a legal move with the pawns? Okay, do you see any other legal move with the pawns? No. no. Do you see a legal move with the cubes? Okay, what can you do with the cubes? Tell me. Can you take away three? What is it? I can take away two of these. Two threes, okay. Take out six. You take away two threes, which are six. Okay, do that. Take away the two threes, which are six. And what's going to happen to this nine? It's, three. it's going to become a three. Okay, the, the cube for the three is on the other side, on the floor. So now you have three x's where it's three, so how much is each x? One. One. Over here, please write x equals to one. Wonderful. Now let's clear the scale in order to do the check. Let's clear the scale to do the check. And let's set up the original problem one more time. So you have two x's. plus 3, and we're going to do that a second time, and on the other side we have x plus 9, good, and we just said that, that x is equal to 1. So let's try that, if x is 1, how much do I have on this side? Why don't you begin with the two threes? Three and three is? Six. And one more? Seven. Eight. Ten. Eight altogether is ten. So on this side, please write ten equals. That's the value of this side of the equation. And on the other side, how do you know you have ten on the other side? 9 and 1 is 10. Okay, very nice. And how old are you? 6. 6 years old.